طلاب الأعزاء كلية الحدباء قسم اللغة الإنجليزية المرحلة الرابعة السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أرحب بكم في درس جديد من دروس النحو الإنجليزي Transformational Grammar وموضوع اليوم هو The Passive Transformation How to do or to make passive transformation If we take the following example The apple was eaten by Jane As you know, this is a passive sentence. The first step we do is to extract the deep structure of this sentence. So we say, Jane passed eat the apple. This is what? This is the deep structure of the sentence. The second step, as you know, we draw the tree diagram of the deep structure. So the tree diagram here we have S, the sentence, then we have the nucleus, which is divided into MP1, VP, MP, we have N, which is Jane, the VP is divided into auxiliary, which contains tense, which is past, and we have uh, main verb, which is divided into verb, eat, and MP2, which is divided into determiner, the, and noun, apple. Now, after drawing the tree diagram, we write the terminal string of the uh, deep structure. So the terminal string here is what? Is MP1 plus past plus verb plus MP2. Now we do the passive transformation. We put uh, MP2 at the beginning of the terminal string. We have MP2 plus past plus B plus EN. This is the difference. We add what? Here we add B plus EN before the verb because it is passive. So passive requires what? B plus EN. Then we have by plus MP1 by plus mp1 when we draw the tree diagram of this passive sentence we have s sentence nucleus which is divided into mp and vp mp is divided into this is mp2 by the way determiner and noun the apple vp auxiliary within auxiliary we have tense B plus EN, tense is past, B, B, and EN, EN. Then we have the main verb, which is divided into verb, eat, and prepositional phrase. Here we have a prepositional phrase, by plus MP1. This is a prepositional phrase, which is analyzed into preposition and noun. Preposition is by, and the noun is Another example, another example, the letter could have been written by Tom. The deep structure, Tom could have written the letter. The tree diagram, we draw the tree diagram of this sentence. We have sentence, nucleus, MP1 noun which is tom vp we have auxiliary tense within the auxiliary we have tense past and we have modal and have plus en the main verb we have the verb right and the uh, other noun phrase or the second noun phrase mp2 which is analyzed to determiner and noun now we write the terminal string of this deep structure we have mp1 plus past plus modal plus have plus en plus verb plus mp2 then we do what we do the passive transformation mp2 plus past plus modal plus have plus en plus b plus en now here we we have the the change here b plus en 
beside changing the two noun phrases, we have B plus EN plus verb plus by plus MP1 plus MP1. So, the tree diagram of this sentence is sentence S nucleus MP2, which is analyzing to determina and noun. Determina is the noun letter. And we have the verb phrase, which is analyzing to auxiliary. We have tense within auxiliary, which is past, modal, have a plus en, b plus en. And we have the main verb, which is analyzed into verb, right, and prepositional phrase. Then the prepositional phrasing is analyzed into preposition, by, and the noun, uh, tone. Thank you so much.